other video uh, on uh, liquify tool. I did quickly on one about the body and the body shape on the last one, um, quite briefly. And this one's going to be trying to change your face, okay? So, as if you've watched my other video, you will know, uh, go up to filter, liquify. Okay, so from here you know all the tools and what they do. And I'm just going to move that up, click that. And what you're going to do is simply, as you can see, she's got more, she's got quite a rounded face. So you just simply move it up. A bit wide there. Doesn't matter if there's a gap at the side. From here, you can always do that afterwards. Basically, it's got to be roughly the same sort of length, the chin. You can't have bits which don't look right. Okay. Okay, something like that, okay. So I'm just gonna go out and hopefully that you can see the difference. Zoomed in and zoom out. That's what she was before, that's what she is now. A simple, uh, this was just using the first tool in there, the warp tool, and you can see the uh, what it does to a uh, part of your body. And uh, this is just for the face. Um, I can do a similar thing again. Filter, liquefy. Just do something quickly. I'll use that was the forward warp tool that I used for the the chin. Now what I'm going to use is the uh, the I think it's the pucker tool. Just to make a, a nose a bit smaller. And just brush, get, just click over. You want to take your time with this because you don't want to go too silly. That's why I was taking my time on um, parts. And basically, you've got to do the same both sides. Something like that will do. And yeah, click OK. And there's the difference. Simply by moving, uh, using this liquify tool, it's very good and very powerful for um, companies that do publishing um, so they can get the perfect image of the perfect girl um, hopefully you can um, use this uh, tool have fun with it comment rate subscribe and uh, look at my other videos and like always see you next time